guys, it's me, Badbrook Studio, and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to show you two simple ways how to create a desaturation or black and white effect as you can see it on screen right now. So as you can see this sprite here is displayed black and white and it's just a normal costume. So I'm going to show you how to do this effect. The first method is a bit more complicated but here we go. So we will make a clone of this sprite when the green flag is clicked or whenever you want to. And this clone will go to the front layer, set its ghost effect to 50 and its color effect to 100. And if we start the project, you can see this is all black and white, but if we decide to now move our character, you can see that this is the blue version of the fox. So we change the color effect to be exactly opposite of the sprite's normal color. And so the colors like blend in and the effect is that it get, gets all black and white. But the downside to this is that when we want to move our sprite, the clone will have to move too and if we want to now switch costumes, this suddenly doesn't work anymore. So we would have to put things in the code of the clone to always have the exact same costume direction and position as the normal sprite. There is a simpler way though. This involves no clones, but simply to set the color effect to this. This effect is a bit darker, but it is a lot simpler and if we like switch costumes here, you can see that it instantly works. What this does is sets the color to infinity, which Scratch seems not to be able to handle so it converts it to black and white. This makes it a lot darker but by using a second thing we can change up the brightness, set the brightness to for example 10 and can achieve that it looks a lit little bit more like the other one. And we could also add a slider here or a variable and then just forever make it change to the variable and then just set the variable to zero and we can slot increase it and you can see that it gets lighter and we can also set the variable to a slider and then just change the amount of black and white effect this has so this is it Thanks for watching, I hope this helped you in your projects and see you in another video, bye.